Welcome to the StarWars.com 10, a feature where the StarWars.com editorial staff huddles to discuss in committee various topics relating to a galaxy far, far away. In this installment of the StarWars.com 10, we're picking the galaxy's best handmade uniforms, armor, and outfits from Sith styles to Coruscant couture. For this list, we're focusing on costumes from the Star Wars films only, ranking them on design, originality, and cool factor. The first outfit featured on our galactic runway is the Imperial Guard uniform. Combining robes, a helmet, and armor, along with an aggressive red color, it's a menacing look, though it fails to impress some critics. Bland and lifeless, yet sharp and intimidating, the Imperial Officer uniform is perfect for the Empire's military leaders. Usually seen in olive and black variations, it's successful in its simplicity, but fails in other important areas. For Lando Calrissian, the clothes don't completely make the man, but they certainly say a lot about him. And the smooth-talking smuggler's Cloud City getup speaks volumes. It's dapper, daring, and a little dangerous. In other words, it's totally Lando. Its intent, to demean and embarrass, what it becomes, a symbol of empowerment. Leia's metal bikini, consisting of form-fitting swirls and attractive fabrics, is a stunning design. But it takes on a new meaning when the rebel princess turns the tables on the crime lord that forced her to wear it. It's a truly explosive look, and a memorable one. Synonymous with the Rebel Alliance, the Rebel Pilot flight suit is defiantly bright, rugged, and altogether a visual opposite to the Empire's cold, drab uniforms. Right now, I feel like I take on the whole Empire myself. If we were wearing this gear, Dac, we'd feel the same way, too. Simple meets swashbuckling. Jedi robes and tunics illustrate the selfless and courageous nature of our light side heroes, while subtle differences allow for personality, showing that you can be yourself while guarding peace and justice and look good doing it. What does a queen from a galaxy far, far away wear? This, featuring flowing reds and ornate details. Padme's Naboo lantern gown is both familiar and otherworldly. Of all her regal outfits, it remains the most elegant, strange, and beautiful. Stormtrooper armor is exactly what the Empire needs its ground forces to be. Uniform, faceless, and threatening. While it may not be completely functional, I can't see a thing in this helmet. This gear and all its variations stand as striking creations and definitively Imperial. The epitome of underworld cool. From helmet to jetpack to Wookiee scalps, Boba Fett's armor is filled with clever details. It combines shapes and colors in inventive ways, all the while conveying mystery and a no-nonsense attitude. Who can question Darth Vader? What if he doesn't survive? Bounty hunters that look this awesome. It is nightmarish. It is powerful. It is Darth Vader. The Sith Lord's life support armor blends seemingly disparate elements, a frightening mask, futuristic mechanical components, and an ominous black color scheme to create something new. Ultimately, it fully illustrates Vader's evil nature and hints at his tragic history, making it iconic and one of a kind. That's why we rank it number one. So what do you think? Did we overlook something? Did we nail it? Are we out of our minds? Comment and let us know.